Anarchism, a political philosophy and movement that seeks to abolish oppressive systems. It's been around since Pierre-Joseph Proudhon declared property is theft in 1840 and features opposition to all forms of hierarchical control. The increasingly frequent misrepresentation of anarchism by the media to be about violence, nihilism, or disorder is truly debatable, as anarchists seek to reduce or even end violence and oppression. It seeks liberation from oppressive systems of control, including but not limited to the state, governmentalism, capitalism, racism, sexism, ableism, speciesism, and religion. Anarchists advocate a self-managed, classless, stateless society without borders, bosses, or rulers, where everyone takes collective responsibility for the health and prosperity of themselves and the environment. Fundamentally opposed to the monopolization of property, anarchism systematically denies possession because it acts as an instrument of oppression. Generally, anarchists advocate socialism instead of capitalism, as they believe that under this system, workers have little autonomy or control over themselves. Developments in technology and social movements have led to new forms of anarchist organizing and the application of anarchist ideas in various fields, such as education and ecology. In today's world, anarchism's gone digital. Hacktivists use anarchist principles to fight for digital freedom. Social justice advocates grapple with how to create non-hierarchical spaces in a hierarchical world. One way to understand anarchism is to read Paul Goodman, Noam Chomsky, Proudhon, Thoreau, Kropotkin, Tolstoy, Emma Goldman, Ursula Kay, and many of the rest. Anarchism is not a fixed ideology, but a perpetual critique of power. It's a willingness to question and challenge authority, to create new forms of organization and coordination that are more humane and more efficient. It's a never-ending experiment in creating a world that's more free, more just, and more beautiful. And I will see you in the next one.